you must commit to your shot, especially if you're going to hit a short ball. So here's a quick serve plus one point that I did. Um, here's me. I'm about to serve, and Andrew here is about to return. And here's the point. Here's a little short ball. And a backhand down the line winner from me. So let's back up here and take a look at what happened here. And so as I'm about to hit this shot, uh, it's somewhat of a floater of a return. And obviously I have a million options to go to. I have a backhand down the line, which I did, but I also have a backhand cross court. I could also run around it and hit a forehand inside out, a forehand inside in. I could go maybe straight to the center. Maybe I could do a drop shot. Who knows, a drop shot cross court. Many, many options I could go with. And that's the key um, in regards to the commitment. You have to go with one shot. You have to go with what it is in your gut, what it is that you feel like is the best shot at that particular moment in time and go for that shot. Go for that shot 110%. And Andrew knows my game here. Um, he usually, he probably usually thinks that I go backhand cross court here or any type of cross court. I like to approach to uh, the opponent's backhand side, but I saw this open space here and I really wanted it. And I know that if I hit something that's kind of weak around here, Andrew will run it down with his forehand and bust it for a, a forehand cross court. So I really wanted this backhand down the line to be hard and pretty much a winner. And so as I'm about to hit this ball, a lot of players get into this problem where maybe you see your opponent shift a little bit. Uh, he's getting closer to this area right here, right? And so you could change your swing mid-swing, but what happens is if you do change your swing, you're probably going to make a mistake right here. Say I change my mind and just go cross court here. It's not going to work. It's probably going to go to the net or just a really bad shot. And you never want to do that. You want to commit to that shot. I wanted this. I wanted this with my whole heart and soul. And I went for it. I went for it. Maybe I'll miss. Maybe not, but I will commit to that shot. And these short balls need 110% commitment. You can't just uh, say, oh, maybe I'll go here. No, if you want that, it has to be 110%. And what makes that a 110% shot? Well, you know, it's not, nothing really analytical. It's nothing really that you deduce or plan it out. It's by feeling decision making most of it in the moment is simply gut feeling this was a gut feeling that i had and you should have in your game and you just go with it right along with it commit to it and that will be a good shot most of the time that will be a good shot and you know i was actually a little bit off balance on this shot uh, but I really wanted it. Maybe a, maybe slightly split second late. But, you know, I went for that. And if I could get to that spot, I knew I would win that point. So commit to your shots, especially on the short balls. Um, otherwise, it will backfire on you. Uh, you need that commitment. Uh, you need to just go for it and trust in your shot. If you enjoyed this video, kindly do me a favor and hit that like and subscribe button. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.